we've just returned from our first international urbex trip since 2019, a two-week journey across the countries of Spain and Portugal. We visited all types of locations, from power plants and prisons, to water parks and palaces. This time, we even ventured slightly outside the realm of adventures into the abandoned. These episodes will be releasing periodically over the next several months, and you definitely won't want to miss them. To kick things off, we're exploring a massive abandoned hospital in Madrid. Founded in the 1960s, it was a university-run hospital where some of Spain's most important research on organ transplants took place. By the 2000s, the facility was becoming too outdated, and an entirely new hospital was built to replace it. Once all the operations had been transferred, the old building was abandoned, left to sit silently in decay. Now, join us as we venture inside and see what's left. Thanks to Skillshare for sponsoring this portion of today's video. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring and creative classes for anyone who loves learning. Their in-depth courses are perfect for people who want to make their passion a full-time job or just want to progress in an area they're passionate about. There are so many great classes such as this one that go in-depth into the more advanced features of Adobe Premiere Pro, which is what we use to make all of our videos. This class goes beyond the basics and covers many more intricate parts of the software like multi-camera editing, 2D animations, keyframes, as well as audio and color grading. It's really a great class for anyone looking to learn all of the ins and outs of editing with Premiere Pro. Additionally, every course has a community discussion where you can ask questions and meet like-minded people working towards a similar goal. The first 1,000 viewers to sign up using the code THEPROPERPEOPLE or with the link in the description will get a one month free trial of Skillshare with unlimited access to classes. Start exploring your creativity today. As you may have noticed from this drone footage, there's a couple of security guards present. Somehow, this was completely unknown to us even after we made it into the building. Oh yeah, and they weren't too happy about us flying our drone either. Fortunately, this footage is from after we successfully explored the entire hospital, and nobody was the wiser, even after a little bit of questioning by the Policia Nacional. So, let's rewind the clock a bit and begin our exploration. Look at how they were barricading the door. Jeez, they took all the furniture and just... I wonder if we were having trouble getting in here. Oh my god, there's junk everywhere. Hey, really? There's Jeez. a number here. This is uh, physical therapy. Yeah. We know where all those physical therapy things went. Where'd they go? Against that door oh, over there. Yeah. This is another radiological room. Oh, it's here. Is this CT scan? I don't know, it's definitely not an MRI. MRI is the thing you go inside. Donuts. It's more different than an x-ray for sure. Polytron, it says over <laughs> there. Multi-star T.O.P. Nineteen ninety-six is when this was manufactured. Mm 
it's eerily quiet in this building. It is. I just realized there's some film slides here, or photo slides here. Are these like of what this, oh yeah, this is what this uh, scanner saw. Looks like a cross section of a brain. Or maybe of a lung up a body. That looks more like a chest cavity. Someone's balls. Someone's balls. I have no idea what that is. Oh, it's a pancreas, right? Yeah, it says. They got some curvy hallways in here. They do. The whole building is curvy. Those are just offices. Here, this is the bridge to the chapel. Okay. Yeah, let's check that out. There's lights on in here. All right, let's go to the chapel. There's a lot of stuff in this hall. All these printers. IV hangers. The inside of the chapel is a lot wow. uglier than the outside. Yeah, what the hell? There was a crazy looking window. Yeah, they wall that off? Or is that above us? I think it's above us. Yeah. Let's go up a floor. Yes. Only down? Hmm. Should we... Find a way to go up in the hall. There's no stairs over here, so yeah. we'll have to get to that later. Look at this, there's a hole in the floor here. Do you want to continue on this floor or do you want to try to get in the chapel now? Well, let's continue on this floor. We'll, okay. Let's see what's up with the power being on over here. Yeah. That's a little sus. torn apart but yeah x-ray this hospital does not seem very out of date I wonder why it was abandoned what is this projector that's interesting you were just saying how this hospital seems very new and then this seems very old yeah there's a reel here too We're so visible to all those apartments from here. Whatever. I've found a main staircase, but we should stick to this floor first. This is uh, negative one, so this is not even like the main floor. One level below the main floor. Let's try these doors. Some kind of a laboratory in here. Anything? Yeah, a lab. It's all blown open though. Yeah. I wonder why the windows are just completely removed here. Curving. The whole place is curvy. More labs. Something here. Check this out. It's a blood refrigerator. This 
This is where they'd keep all the donated blood ready for transfusions, probably. Yeah. There's a lot of books in this office. Check this out. A defibrillator, right? Yeah. Clear. Yeah. Now, is this something Good. different up here? I don't know. I think so. Because this is its own thing. The aren't going to be able to print out or anything. This is just here. Yeah. Like, it's just put here. This could be like a polygraph or an EKG or something. Does it have a place? Yeah, it has a place for probes. Power and graffiti. Interesting. This would have been a main entrance here. This is probably an emergency room. Yeah. Right? Barricaded. If there's a place for to drive up here, maybe there's an ambulance lane. Take a look around. Ooh, it's dark in here. Found some x-rays. 1984. Emergency room through here, maybe? Should we check this out first? Sure. Okay. Ooh, that goes down. Turn your light off. You see us? Oh, is that daylight? Yeah, the roof is gone up there, I'm assuming. Yeah, there's holes in the roof. Wow. Or oh, actually, looks like a skylight that they, they drywalled up. over. Okay. This hallway is looking rough. This is a cafeteria. That tile wall looks nice, but nothing else does. No. Some waiting room chairs in here. Ooh, microscope. Big one. And a spiral staircase. Um, Patient information, of course. Yeah, that staircase is interesting. There's dumb waiters here too. PD, PVDF membrane. Very cool. Gyratory shaker model G2 from Edison, New Jersey. Yeah, this is like... Look at this poster. Oh, yeah. A little bit of your blood can save a life. It's an ad to donate blood. This part of the hospital looks a bit more dated. In a good way. In a good way. It's an interesting shaped room. This All kind right. of ceiling is very, like, 70s, 80s. Yes. All right. Which corner of the triangle should we check out? I mean, those doors look interesting. Yeah. So do these. Those look like the Let's chairs. Let's work our way right right there left. on purpose. Let's see what this is. Yeah. Maybe it's blocking people coming in here. It's dark. It's an auditorium. It's smelly. Ooh, yeah. Very 70s. Somebody blasted the uh, 
fire extinguishers. Of course. Anything. Nope. That would have been nice. Yes. All right, let's see what's downstairs here. Oh, it goes down again. Experimental surgery. Okay. Bioengineering. That's interesting. Yeah. Let's give it a look. This is a surgical room of some kind. Yeah, it's an operating room. Light's gone. Got vacuum pump and electrical hookups up here. Yeah. That's a really small table. It is. Autoclave. What are these doors for? I don't know. Everything is so much more simplistic than what I'm used to seeing. This yeah. is like one of the most modern abandoned hospitals you've ever been in. Check out this exam thing. An eye exam. We got Carl Zeiss made in West Germany. That'll date it a bit. Check out what they did in front of the door. Jeez. You have a wire to pull the thing shut. It's crazy. Yeah. Here's another experimental area. Oh, this is way better stocked. Really? Look at these shelves. There's actually stuff left in here. Yeah, it's all just books. Like binders. Well, mostly, stuff. there's a few there's pieces like, of lab equipment. What is this? What am I looking at? Bacteria of some kind. Got a fume hood here. It's a nice one. You need to head that way more to the main staircase. Yeah. We were getting anxious to find the main operating rooms, so we headed back towards the main part of the hospital. That's where he went down before. Yeah. The gurney. This is the part of power.
Empty. Empty room. Big surprise. We found the old technology room. A Macintosh SE. It looks like it's in good shape too. It's not even yellowed that bad. Got some oscilloscopes in here. Going up. Rectangular glass blocks. Yeah. Actually, I haven't seen that before. Let's just take a peek. Let's go left first. Yeah. There's a double door at the end. These are actual patient rooms. Okay. Yeah, they're numbered. Two beds. I see a pile of furniture. Yeah. That's a pile. What's going on? Probably looks like that on the other side. Yeah. It's a lot of waiting chairs. They're in fact just chilling. This looks like a main area. Check With that door barricaded, we had to go around the long way. But as we reached the other it's side, this happened. List of what's on each floor. Yeah, this is a big lobby. Yeah, look, what's on each floor is right here. There's the thing we thought was the security booth.
We were pretty surprised to learn security was present since we had walked a few laps around the property before going in, and even walked right past the security booth inside the main perimeter fence. But some of those suspicious powered on rooms we saw earlier definitely should have been a red flag. Just a casual hiding from security inside the building apparently. We've been hiding in this closet in the church because his voice got really close. I haven't heard it for a bit. I think we need to venture out and try to find those two rooms we're trying to find. We know there's like an autopsy room in here and a really cool circular operating room with a skylight. But we don't know where they are. I think our mission now is to just sort of find those rooms and then get out. We gotta be really stealthy. try to get up or down somewhere away from this front door because I feel like he came in this front door right to the booth so creepy sounding. I think so. Is this something about observations? Areas of observation, yeah. Operation zone, yeah. Okay, I think we're open. We're here, we're close. This is not where we wanna be.
got lights. Oh shit. This is a cool one. It's hanging on. Looks like the ceiling's gonna fall down. Yeah, but the light should be mounted better than the yeah. ceiling. I like that it's like decayed around it. This is for doctors to clean up before surgery. Wow, these are a lot of rooms. These were all the sterile cabinets. They really had a lot of rooms. They could do a lot of surgeries around that. I think we gotta go to the other end. Yeah. So, like, These like vital sign monitors. It says like bed number four, one, two, three. staircase. We'll come back here in a second. Third floor has all of these rooms. Lots of operating rooms. Well, five of them, I guess. Reanimation. What? Look, they use them. So operating for surgery. Just a locker room. Are these like lab coats and stuff? Not like, curtain. Yeah. We found it. Oh shit, we Holy found it. Holy fuck. It's a nice room. This is so much better than anything else in this building. Oh yeah. Oh my god. The light's cracked. This is so cool. This is definitely the best modern operating room I've ever been in. It's basically a modern operating theater. I mean, there's nowhere to observe. The window's up there. That's for observation? I'm sure of it. Oh. I thought it was just to let light in, but no. you're right. That's like where you can see down with the Yeah. Door. They have pads up there probably so you don't bump your head as you're observing. Because yeah. it looks pretty low. Gomco vacuum glass thing, whatever it is. I feel like I'm back at home now. 
There's another one over here. Let's see if the other one looks just as cool. No, there's like nothing in this one. It's still got that really cool observation area though. Yeah. Just like an office desk in here, that's strange. Just like furniture's moved around in here very weirdly. Walking down the road right there. Did you get him on camera? I don't know if I got him. God, I can't zoom enough. Where was he? He walked that way. From where? He's still on the phone. From the front door. Really? Oh, the car's coming in. You're kidding. Car in, car in. A porta potty. Uh, He's here to clean out the porta potty. He's got a shit and it's full. Oh my god. I'm telling you, he was in that box when I walked by it. Yeah, they're cleaning the shitter now. That's hilarious. So it's nothing with us. He came out of the box or the front door of the hospital? Walking down the steps. So he was inside the hospital. Yes. Maybe trying to look for a clean toilet. <laughs> He's still talking to the porta potty guy. We should go now. Okay. With security preoccupied, we figured it would be a good time to sneak back downstairs and attempt to locate the morgue. This is kind of confusing. Yeah. Should we go down on this side of the building and cross over lower? I don't want to cross over in front of the main entrance. Okay. Let's just go down as low as we can here and then go that way. I don't want to go on the first and ground level anymore. Have, there's like two ground levels. There's like a double height well, entrance. There's on that side. zero, one, and like negative one that all had ground level connections. Yeah. like right below the surgical suite. I think it was in those labs we were at before. Could be there too. Needed to go down. It's really lit up in here. Is this all electricity? Yes. I think he could come in here. Yeah, he could. All I know is these windows are at the right height for what we're looking for. Yeah. I've I think it's below surgery. But the blue tiling and that are matched the labs you were in down this way. I'm gonna All right, check this. Let's first. go check that first then. But it's back and forth. I mean we're already here. This is surgical too anyway. Yeah. I feel like I'm in Kowloon Walled City or something. They're right above us, hopefully they don't bounce. Keep your mouth closed. Yeah, we'll get back in. But they'd pull up a stretcher with a body on it. Right here. Could have. I have a feeling we're getting close. Yeah. This way. Oh, here it is. Has 
the OG clinic. Wow. Yeah. I've never seen a modern version of something like this. No, me either. It's still pretty cool compared to the old stuff. cool. How much natural light is in here? Here, kill your light. Not much. Yeah, open those a bit more. like a projector screen too, but I don't see where the projector would be. Maybe on this table right there. Yeah, you see the hook on the ceiling? They would hang stuff from that. Maybe the scale? Probably a scale. They have ashtrays all over the seats. People could be smoking in here while you're dissecting a body. Jeez. But don't you know nine out of 10 doctors recommend camel cigarettes? Yeah, these are ashtrays. Is that an overhead in the yeah, box? Yeah, that's what would have projected onto this. Yes. Pretty sweet. Let's get some photos in here and then get out of here before we push our luck. Don't need another close encounter, as fun as it is. Let's see if there's any more autopsy rooms. There might be. Autopsy septica. This one has like a porcelain marble table. Wow. That's, oh shit. That's stone. Yeah, this is an older table. grooves for the blood to drain out. It drains out the bottom here. And this is where the water would come out, I'm assuming? Yeah. Just to... This might be another one. Oh shit, this one is stocked. Oh wow. Look at all those vials. That's a nice one. So much left in this one. the cabinets as well. Yeah. It's just fully stocked. Wow. So many different tubes. Like a couple of everything in this room. Yep. It's a nice 
nice microscope. I've got all these slides in here. Got some COVID tests. Tests of some kind. Fluid samples of some kind. Yeah, these autopsy rooms really made the place. This was an awesome hospital. I think it's time we head out though. It's only a matter of time before security does a round and bumps into us. Mm -hmm.